we have a car of mass, 580 kilograms. So here is our car. And that car collides with the rear of a stationary van of mass 1200 kilograms. Okay, so the car is going forwards, let's say. It hits the van. The van has a mass of 1200 kilograms and it is stationary. And then it says, well actually, let's just first state that this is before the collision. This is now going to be after the collision. So after the collision, we have the van moves with a velocity of 6.2 meters per second. So that's now going, obviously, in this direction with a speed of 6.2 meters per second. And the car recoils. So the car now goes backwards after the collision. So it goes towards the left with a speed of 1.6 meters per second. And then we're trying to work out the initial speed of the car, so I'll call that V. So to do this question, we have to consider momentum conservation. The momentum before a collision should be equal to the momentum after a collision. Now, momentum is a vector, so we have to define a positive direction. Let's say to the right is positive. So the initial momentum would be, so remember that mass, momentum is equal to mass times velocity. So the initial momentum would be 580 times V, and that would be positive as it's going towards the right. And the final momentum would be, so that of the van, 1200 times 6.2, positive again as it's going towards the right, minus this momentum, which is going towards the left, hence the minus, so minus 580 times 1.6. So the right-hand side gives me 6512, and then we can divide both sides by 580, and we end up with 11.2, so that would be option B.